2nd of May 2022 Welcome back to my cosy corner of the internet. Here I select a tarot deck each week from my extensive collection to elucidate the ethers and scry the shifting celestial tides on behalf of the collective. These readings are not aimed at any particular person and you are meant to find them at the time their guidance is most relevant to you. So please take only what resonates with you and leave the rest behind. My musings are intended to inspire, uplift and guide you on your healing journey. If you like what you find here, please share this page with your friends. One good deed deserves another and because your engagement really helps me out. If you like, share or comment, I hope and intend that you will be blessed with bountiful beneficence this week. This month I'm celebrating 18 years of Maya Star. It's hard to believe I've been teaching and inspiring people to learn healing and meditation techniques in order to enhance their lives for that long. But I guess time really does fly when you're having fun and I love what I do with all my heart and soul. In the past 18 years, I've worked with over 3,000 students all around the world and taught over 10,000 attunement-based energy healing courses. When I founded Maya Star, I had no idea it would become the beacon for light work as it is today. It's been a fantastic 18 years of heart-centered, soul-inspiring work. Maya Star has continued to grow, evolve, improve and provide an increasingly diverse range of attunement-based energy healing and spiritual development courses, as well as advanced certification options for those who wish to become healers and offer treatments professionally. Maya Star's magic wouldn't exist without my beloved students and clients and the interest and support of all of those that follow my work here and on all my social media channels. See the links in the description to find my Instagram, Facebook, Tumblr, Twitter, DeviantArt, Pinterest and LinkedIn. So I want to extend an enthused and impassioned thank you to you all. You are deeply appreciated. Everything happens for a reason and if you're reading or listening to this, my love and appreciation is extended to you. I believe people find Maya Star at the time they will benefit most from my work. It's always been my intention that the universe guide people to my work when the time is right for them and that all will prosper and progress through that connection. I look forward to another 18 years of sharing the light and love through Maya Star and I'm excited to see how things evolve and expand as our journey continues. And now, we turn to the work at hand. I've chosen the Paulina Tarot for our mystical meanderings. This deck is whimsical, wonderful, and filled with wit and wisdom. I'm sure it will be a powerful translator of the numinous forest today. So sit back, relax your shoulders, 
take a sip of chamomile tea, exhale deeply and let's explore the dominant energetic influence we can tap into over the coming week for the purpose of progressing the spiritual journey and pursuing the path to wholeness is reflected in the Ace of Wands. This card indicates high vibrations and passion this week. So look for the avenues that allow you to express your enthusiasm and energy in order to fuel the fire of creative force that's burning within you. Opportunities for closer alignment with your true self are in the offing, but you need to be ready to take action. Don't sit on the sidelines of your life and applaud. Get out there and do something radical. Maintain your confidence by focusing on the things you can do, and you'll end the week feeling greatly empowered and shining like the star you truly are. The second card identifies the potential opposition we may face in pursuit of the promises of the first card. And this week, this energetic current is reflected in the Seven of Cups. This isn't a negative card by any means, but in this position we're looking at the shadowed aspect of the archetype. This can represent a tendency to dream or fantasize but not take action. It can be about procrastination but it can also be about limiting your possibilities by engaging with wishful thinking rather than taking practical steps to resolve problems. If you think about cleaning your house ten times before you do it once, you've reinforced your resistance to the task and spent a lot more time thinking about it than it would have actually taken to do. That's a tendency to be aware of and avoid this week. In order to align with the Ace of Wands energy, be prepared to act. And now, we turn to the daily cards for the week ahead. These cards depict and define the archetypal energetic influences we can harness to optimise our personal power and increase our inspiration in the coming days. 2nd of May 2022 High Priestess Secret and sacred knowledge is held within so seek your spiritual support through your higher self during your meditations today. Your intuition and dreams communicate important messages but it's in silence that you'll hear them most clearly. The universe reminds you not to be swayed by the opinions and actions of those around you. Keep your own counsel and follow your own path. 3rd of May 2022 The Hanged Man Today's your opportunity to unwind your mind. Disconnect from the drama and mute notifications for a while to give yourself some space to breathe. The universe reminds you that mundane tasks can provide opportunities for meditation too. Zone out while you hoover or chant while you wash the dishes. There are paths to peace in the practical projects of the day. 4th of May 2022 Four of Wands Take time to smell the roses and appreciate abundance. 
Look at your life and recognise the improvement, increase and inspiration that's bloomed. Your commitment to your dreams pays off. The universe reminds you that manifestation is continuous and you co-create your reality. So keep your hopes high and count your blessings often. Love your life and your life will love you back. 5th of May 2022 Six of Swords Today promises progress on your spiritual path. Opportunities for deep healing come when repressed thoughts and feelings rise to our conscious awareness without judgement or upset. Create a healing oasis for yourself with some yoga, energy healing or a relaxing ritual bath. The universe reminds you that rest brings recovery and refreshment. Your soul expands, excels and exceeds past limitations. 6th of May 2022 Four of Cups Face your feelings and front out your floundering motivation. You're about to find your groove again but you can help the process by bringing your focus back to the present moment. The universe reminds you that energy flows where your attention goes and distractions can deplete your determination. You are lifted and limitlessly loved by a light-centric and life-supporting divine source. 7th of May 2022 Strength Your heart expands to embrace your wildness and illuminates the shadows at the edges of your reality. Radical self-acceptance means extending kindness, compassion and charity to yourself. The universe reminds you to nourish your soul by loving yourself unconditionally. Your strength is restored through recognising and rejoicing in your realness. Affirm, my heart embraces my soul, I'm treasured, accepted and whole. 8th of May 2022, Two of Swords. If you've been holding back or sitting on the fence, it's time to dissolve the deadlock and make a decision. You get to determine your direction and you get to do it in your own distinctive way. The universe reminds you that confidence in your divine self isn't misplaced. You have reserves of untapped potential within Align your thoughts with progress and prosper prolifically. This concludes our mystical musings for the week ahead. I hope you've enjoyed your time with me today and that you'll come back again soon. Have a beautiful week. I wish you peace prosperity and progress in all you do. With blessings, 